U.S. consumer prices dipped in March, May 2020. So the year-on-year percent change bar is low, and the headline inflation rate is set to surge to 3.5% or higher just on this historical base effect alone. And we know there are a variety of logistical backlogs impacting prices. From prior to the pandemic shutdown in early 2020, we have seen lumber prices rise 270%, corn up 95%, soybeans up 70%, copper up 60%. Do current rising prices represent transient or permanent inflation pressure? Let's ask the futures market. Many commodities are in backwardation, where the nearby or current price is well above the one-year-out futures price. For example, lumber sells at a 30% discount one-year-out, corn at 23%, soybeans at 16. One interpretation of futures backwardation is that the current high prices are, at least partially and possibly, more temporary than permanent over the long haul.